Hi everyone. Okay, this is the haul that I've been putting off because I've been waiting for Rena to do with me. And I, she just doesn't have time. She's so busy. I'm actually going to attempt to do this by myself. This is a swap I did with Marissa. And I have not given Marissa her stuff yet because I'm actually going to be making her some of my stuff that I do make. I really want to give her something personal. Because, you know, I don't just consider her a friend I met here. I consider her a personal friend of mine. And so, um, I've been sick. And I have not been able to do everything. And I feel so bad about this. Because she's given me her box already. So I'm just like, oh man, every time I go in here I feel so bad. <laughs> but, um, I just want to say, Marissa, girl, I'm, I promise you I'm going to get it to you just... You know, i just been out of it. And um, I can't thank you enough for your generosity and your friendship and your kindness. And what she gave us just blew my mind because I opened this box and I was like, oh my gosh. I told her there is no way I'm going to be able to give you all this kind of stuff because she gave me so much stuff. I don't even have that much stuff to give her. <laughs> So she was so kind and so generous to do this for us and the stuff that she's given us is just amazing and I got a lot of um, Ariel Secret Garden stuff because she does have a lot, a lot of Ariel Secret Garden products and I'm so glad because um, Sheree and Ariel, their soaps are some of my favorite soaps. Her soaps, I have not purchased for a while because her soaps are the ones that I do have the most of. I still have um, some of the first soaps I ever got from Cherie. So I've been trying to use everything from certain products so that I can buy more of that one specific company. Um, and now she's closing her shop. And I was like so devastated over it telling Rena, oh my god, you know, we should have just went in there and bought a whole bunch of stuff from her. And, um, but, you know, I had so much stuff from her. I have more of Cherie soaps than, than anybody else's soaps. But I really don't have as many soaps as you think I do. Because, um, I give a lot of my stuff away. I share with my neighbors. I share with my friends. I share with Rena's friends. So I'm, uh, I don't keep anything for myself. Not that much. If you were to come in my thing, you'd be like, where's all your soap, Mia? Yeah, it's in somebody else's house. So... <laughs> I like to share, you know me, so yeah, I don't have as much soap as you would think. I give a lot of it away. I mean, my other daughter comes and says, like, here, help yourself, help yourself, and everyone comes over, help yourself. So yeah, everyone knows I'm the soap queen, and they come over and they take soap, so. And believe me, they come back for more because they love it. So anyways, this is from Marissa, and I'm going to start trying to go through some of the stuff she gave me. Mmm, Miss George Julius is a bomb. Okay, now, <clears throat> first thing she gave me, I had um, half of one of these already, and Jen had an the other half of the cake, and it was a cake from Sugar Bubbles, which is Candy's company, and um, if you hadn't had a chance to try candy soaps, <sighs> I don't even know what to say, It her soaps are amazing put it this way I would pay extra shipping and everything to get my hands on some of her soaps because they're just that awesome they're moisturizing but they're not super moisturizing um, they remind me a lot a lot of lot of Newton fig soaps they remind me of um, each other's soaps when I try Newton fig I thought oh my gosh these are like candy soaps I mean not identical nobody's soaps are identical but they're very close. They remind me of each other. So <clears throat> when I, I discovered that, I was like, oh my gosh, because I was so devastated. Candy, I couldn't get her stuff no more. So I started getting Newton Fig, which I absolutely love her soaps. But anyways, yeah, so I got one of these, and this is in birthday cake. And I had shared mine um, with, you know, other people because I share everything I get. And I've had so many raves over these soaps. And I was just telling my daughter... Gee, you know, I only have like a couple. If I wish I, I, you know, I would have saved me just one more. And, you know, God is so good. Look, Marissa gave me another one. So this is that. And this is an awesome soap. It smell, it's like a piece of cake, if you could see it. And it smells like um, chocolate and lime. And that is an awesome scent. I'm going to try and open this for you. Just so you could see. 
There you go. Sugar bubbles, and it is a chocolate and lime soap. Yep. Oh, you can smell it through there. Chocolate and lime. Beautiful. <clears throat> I also got another soap from um, Homemade Soap, and it's in tinsel from Fox Run Soaps. Oh, beanie soaps. And this... <sighs> tinsel is an awesome soap because it smells like Christmas candy. That box of Christmas candy that looked like little ribbons and stuff. It's very minty and canty scented. And this is really nice. I like that one. This one is another one of Beanie Soaps. And this one is in Peppermint. Oh my god, Beanie. This is awesome. Mmm. This smells so good. And look at the little presents. I'm assuming that they're little Christmas soaps. Um, what else did I get? I got... A uh, Nickery Bath Treats Key Lime Pie, and this is um, a cake. Mmm, you can smell that through the package too, and that's what it looks like. It just looks like, you know, the piping on top. That's a Key Lime Pie cake. <clears throat> I got, um, what's this one? I got a bag with a piece of Monkey Farts cake in it. And that was from Ariel Secret Garden. It's Monkey Farts Birthday Cake. And this is the Ariel Secret Garden. And it's a blue cake. And there's another piece right there. And that's also, um, yeah, this is Monkey Farts from Ariel Secret Garden. So this is also a Monkey Farts. And that one had a little pumpkin on top. So these are monkey farts. And I know, I'm, I'm like, I'm going to get a lot of monkey farts because I know that's her favorite. And Rena loves monkey farts too. So this is another one from Ariel Secret Garden, and this is Candy Girl, and this is in the pink sugar scent. This is another one from Ariel Secret Garden, and this is Lick Me All Over. Mmm. And this is a nice, sweet, almost like a perfumey scent. I like this one. <clears throat> this is another one. This is from Nature's Essence. Oh my gosh. Nature's Essence, Danny. This made me want to cry <laughs> when I seen this because I was like, oh my god, Danny soap, how awesome is that? She doesn't make her soap at all anymore. And this is a teddy bear and it's in the bite me scent. We, oh my god, this is the best scent ever and this soap is the bomb. Um, honestly, back in the day when she was selling soaps, Danny was my number one favorite, uh, soaps I loved hers and my dad loved them I would buy them for my dad all the time and her soaps were the bomb I was really I cried when she wasn't gonna sell them anymore I was so sad Ugh, bite me smells like a fruit punch seven up and rainbow sherbet and this is a teddy bear and bite me bite me bite me now bite me okay I'm sorry <laughs> really not but whatever um, this is another tinsel from um, Fawkman Soaps. This one is, oh, these are, this is a sample. Here's like, these are samples of lilac. I don't know. It doesn't say where those are from. This one is, oh, Monkey Farts from Ariel Secret Garden. Cherie's Monkey Farts is awesome. This is another, um, this is a uh, cotton headed ninny muggins from Ariel Secret Garden, and this is another piece of Monkey Farts birthday cake. This is um, wow, look at that! <clears throat> I have so much stuff in here, you guys, and you know, I am gonna use it all when someone gives me something, I use it. Okay, I'm sitting here like. This one is, this looks like it's from Ariel Secret Garden. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. It smells like Mardi Gras. And this is a cake and I was stoked. Rena was like, oh my god, that's so awesome. I don't know what this is or where it's from, but look how big. I think this is one of Cherie's. Oh, that smells so good. 
I don't know, but that smells good. It smells like me all over. Look at that. That's beautiful. I'm not done yet. <laughs> this is Nature's Art um, in the Raw Honey I Watch the Kids Do. And I've never gotten this one, Kim. Mm, this smells good. And it's Kim soap, so oh my god, you know that's the bomb. This one is from um, Valhalla Soap Company, Hemp and Bear Shampoo. It's a shampoo bar in Buds and Suds. Ooh, dang. I swear, whenever I try Donna stuff, it always blows my mind because I think, oh, I'm not going to like the way it sounds. I don't like all those herbs or anything. And then I smell them and I fall in love with them. Donna's like my, my scent teacher. I've learned so much from purchasing stuff from her. She's just turned me on to something different. Mm, and this smells amazing, Donna. I haven't seen this on your thing. i got to go back and look because this is the bomb. And that's mine. I'm claiming it. I was so excited. <clears throat> I got um, Sugar Bubbles candies. Uh, two soaps in Purple Hooters. And Purple Hooters is an interesting scent. It's very sweet and fruity and florally at the same time and candy like and I love it so I got two of them I'm like oh my god I'm sugar bubbles I'm breaking out with sugar bubbles today I'm so excited I got a lot of samples sexed up samples um I know that's uh Asa's a vanilla rock and roll sample a lot of those are Asa's so I got a lot of samples from Asa this one was in a little bag, and I'm not really sure. I think this was um, another one of Cherie's. Mmm, that smells good. Rena liked this one. She totally said it's hers, and it's a little Hello Kitty. This is, I'm not sure what it's from, but this looks like one of Kim's. Um, This looks like Kim's. I'm not sure if it is. No, I don't think so. I think that Cherie's, um, that smells like Mardi Gras. Cupcake, look how pretty that is. Okay, <laughs> got glitter all over my fingers. It's okay. Look, my glitter. What a beautiful glitter. I love Mike because he loves glitter so much, like I do. I have another glitter holic like me. Oh my gosh, this is cotton candy from Ariel Secret Garden, and I've never smelled it before. And that is a huge. I gotta say, um. She always gave such generous chunks of soap. Look at that. Um, oh, this smells so good. Look, my hands are big, you guys. Look at that piece of soap. I don't think I've seen a piece of soap. These are like, you know, back in the day when everyone was giving big old giant huge chunks of soap for like under five bucks. <laughs> Which, you know, in all honesty, they should have charged more because they need to make a living and, you know, I know there's a lot of competition out there, but we have to respect the fact that the soap makers, oh, for a lot of them, this is their bread and butter, and, you know, they put a lot of work into it, and they're entitled to charge more than under four bucks for a big chunk like this. Oh my gosh, look at this. This is huge. I could cut it in half and have two big bars of soap. Cherie is beyond generous. So I love so much about her stuff. I mean, she's just so generous. And look at that. And when you get her stuff, you're getting some awesome quality soaps. Hers are some of the best out there. Love Ariel Secret Garden soaps. These are... Uh, L'Occitane in Provence. Savon Extra Du Light. Uh, milk extra gentle soap. Okay, it was an English name. I'm trying to speak when I don't. They smell like soap. <laughs> I'm gonna lie. These are cool though. I don't know where she got these from. They smell like soap. Um, here's a, another. I know that writing. That's Ariel Secret Garden, butt naked. Mmm, look at that heart, you guys. Cherie, oh my gosh, I don't want you to go, Cherie. It's just like the big thing about Cherie soaps here that there's so many of them. I'm kind of flashbacking and I'm realizing just exactly how much I love her soaps right now. And, um, wow, just how much I love her products. And um, it's just reminding me that they are one of my absolute favorite soap companies. And I'm just really devastated right now that 
she's closing down shop so if you guys you know have not had the chance to go and get them I went on there the other day she didn't have very many soaps on there but um get them while you can I'm just gonna say that because if you have to try something you better go on there and hurry up because it's gonna be like Danny's she's gone now and she had some of the best soaps around her Cherie and nature's art uh, Tiggy soaps Sherry soaps. I haven't tried Mike's soaps yet, but he sent me some. I'm really excited about that. I mean, there's a lot of soap makers whose stuff is extremely moisturizing. Uh, uh, sensational soaps. Um, I know there's more in my mind. Oh, uh, Good Earth Spa soaps. Oh, Beacon Creations. Is she pedals now? Kia's. Hi, Kia. Her soaps are the bomb. Her, she has my absolute, one of my absolute favorite soaps is Cider Barrel Soap. I've been going on her website for months looking for cider barrel and I haven't been able to find it <laughs> she has everything else but cider barrel and I'm like what she don't make it no more break my heart girl but that is my absolute favorite soap is um petals uh, cider, bar cider barrel soap and it's very hard to find so it's and only she makes it no I got this one and I believe this is from nature's art I'm not sure oh this smells good I don't know what this is, but what is it? Hold on, hold on. It don't have a, um, it's yellow and red and like a blue color. Oh my God, this, uh, Marissa, if you know what this is, please let me know because I would love to get more. This is a unique scent, unlike anything I've ever smelled. It's beautiful. Gorgeous. And it's like a blue with red and yellow. Look what I got. I got another soap from Nature's Art, and this is Hawaiian Plumeria. I hate flowers. I hate florals. I mean, I do rose okay and lilac okay. So when I see this, I'm like, hmm, I know Marissa don't like floral either, you know. Even Kim doesn't really like floral that much. I thought, oh, wow, who am I going to have to give this to? Absolutely nobody, because I just discovered I love Plumeria. It smells sweet and lightly floral, almost like if you're, you have a lay on your neck. This is a beautiful scent, you guys. It smells like a sweet lay. It's not really hardcore flower. And I can actually do this. It smells very summery. Hawaiian Plumeria. Okay, I'm going to announce it to the world. Mia loves with a passion Hawaiian Plumeria. It's gorgeous. And last, I got Nickery Bath Treats. This is Aces. And this is Rose Clay Triple Butter. Oh, I have one of these in my house, and it is a bomb. If you ever get a chance to try anything, her Rose Clay Triple Butter is extremely, extremely um, moisturizing. It is awesome. It actually, I was having a bunch of stuff. I didn't feel well, and I actually um, used it. And it made me feel better. She gave me two of these. My daughter Alexis took the other one. And this is a Nature's Essence Lip Balm in Cucumber Melon. And um, it's really nice. Uh, actually, I was hesitant because some lip balms, they, they burn my lips. And I remember when she did a tester, she asked me to test it. And actually, the one that she did burned my lips but didn't burn my daughter's. And my daughter loved it. She took it. And so when she's saying that, I had another one. Alexis was like, swoop. <laughs> she was like, do you want it? She goes, yeah, yeah. She took it. So so this is my swap with Marissa. Now, I totally don't have this much stuff to give her. And I told her that. But she went ahead and she sent me all this beautiful stuff anyways. And I just want to say thank you, Marissa, so much for everything. I absolutely love this. Now that I did this video, I can actually start using it. And I know which one I'm going to start using it with. Where's the soap I want to start using it with? Because <laughs> I told Marissa, I'll show you what I'm going to use at first. So the one I choose to use before anything else is this one. I am going to use this beautiful cotton candy soap from Ariel Secret Garden because the soap is the bomb. So woohoohoo! Here we go. Alright everyone, if you haven't gotten uh, anything from Cherie and Ariel or if you haven't tried anything, please go out there and get you some because she's going to be closing shop pretty soon. 
and yeah it won't be so easy to get I think she said she's gonna make it but you have to call her you have to get a hold of her through email or something but she won't be online to sell anymore and yeah it's and I feel so bad because you know she has such beautiful products so all right um thanks to Marissa for this beautiful swap I can't wait for you to get my stuff when I get it to you uh, I'm not finished yet. I was really, really, really sick yesterday. I mean, I was just like couch bound. Um, but I'm trying. I'm trying still to do it. So please forgive me. I'm just slow right now. But I'll get it to you, I promise, okay? And um, you have a good trip, Marissa. Bye, everyone. God bless you.